the league. As a matter of fact, they hold opposing teams to just 40 and a half percent from the floor. Easily the best in the league as Wade Baldwin connects for the first points for the Legends tonight. Mentality. He's definitely filling, fulfilling that role. And they've got some good looks starting off at the beginning of the game. Wade Baldwin, two for his first two, and the Legends back within one. Stepped inside this time, but comes up short. Baldwin, the drive and the finish. He blew right on by. Yeah, speaking of being afraid of people with on the break. Ready to check into the game. Baldwin. Off the window. He bumped right into Warney. No call, and he's still able to finish. Done. Tristan Burrell and Xavier Johnson also into the game off the bench. The only starter on the floor, Wade Baldwin. Finger rolls at home. He's got 10 points. Baldwin using the screen. And he finishes that one. He's a simple warm-up shot. Minute mark here in the opening quarter. Baldwin has had a great quarter. Adds to it. 14 first quarter points for James Hart. I mean, Wade Baldwin. Go with the high ball screen again. Horns look, and he's just taking full advantage, coming off with his left hand. Really nice touch off the glass there by Wade Baldwin. Go percentage. But these guys all lock in defensively, and they all probe and drive the lane. Baldwin, the bucket and the foul. He's now got 18 first half points with a chance to add one more. Any way, shape, or form. This is a straight line drive to, with his left hand on the baseline. Late help and the foul. Baldwin. Tough shot. 21 for him. Kind of speaks to how he's passed the baton off to others who have carried the scoring load. And Baldwin, nice move. Opened up for a minute out cross there. And he has a, we used to call that a, a, a Statue of Liberty dunk. The Knicks have given up 55% shooting from the floor. We talked about this earlier. And as Baldwin finishes. Allen when John Jenkins will get back. And we do wish the family of Isaiah Hicks well. Uh, as he hopefully is, uh, his family is on the mend. And hopefully he comes back.